This tip will get you, your device and your data ready for a Genius Bar appointment. Hello, I'm William Gallagher for Apple Insider. If you've got an appointment coming up with an Apple Store Genius Bar, make sure you're ready for it. You've already seen how long it takes to get one appointment. Let's take some steps to make sure you don't need to make it two. First, whatever your problem and whatever your device, bring your Apple ID information to the store and take a moment to be certain it's the right one. Many of us have multiple Apple IDs. So which is the one for the device you're bringing into the store? You need the email address, the password, and for iOS, also the pass code. Next, back up everything. You should be doing this anyway, but there's an extra reason to do it now, which is just this. If your device goes in for a repair, it might not come out the way it went in. Drives may be swapped, software might be reinstalled, maybe Apple will just replace the entire thing. On a Mac, use something like Carbon Copy Cloner and an external hard drive or two. On an iPhone or iPad, back up to iCloud. You're doing this automatically already, but force it to back up now by going to settings, tapping on your name, then on iCloud, then scrolling down to iCloud Backup. Tap into there and then after half a moment, you'll get a Backup Now button. Tap that and make sure you let it finish. On your Apple Watch, well, now that sounds tricky, doesn't it? Because there is no Backup button on the watch. True, there also isn't a lot of data on your watch either, but there are faces and complications and settings. Force the watch to automatically back up those now by unpairing it from your iPhone. All of this is easy to say if your watch and your iPhone and your iPad and your Mac are working. If they are so broken that you can't even switch them on, you're stuck. You'll probably just live with it, trust Apple not to peek at your holiday snaps, and then if the drive is replaced, you'll probably just hope the old one is disposed of safely. However, even in this case, there is something you can do to protect sensitive data on your device. You can erase it remotely. It won't magically wipe everything when the machine is switched off, but if that machine is revived, then it will start to be wiped. Go to iCloud.com, click on Find iPhone, and soon you'll get a map showing where all of your Apple devices are, iPhone, iPad, everything, where they are now or where they were recently. Click on any of those and you can wipe them from right here. Or rather, you can if you have Find My iPhone or Mac or iPad set up first. So set that up now before you have a problem. Start backing up your devices now too before you have a problem. Be prepared and you'll leave your Genius Bar appointment knowing your device is ready for them to repair and that your data is safe. Do you use the Genius Bar or are you able to fix your Apple devices yourself? Do tell us in the comments below. Enjoy that video? Click like and press on that subscribe button. Be sure to check out the Apple Insider price guide that has the best deals on Apple devices and is updated daily. Follow us on social media and we'll see you guys in the next video.